Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So, vectors from philippic.com, I will add the online link and project files. First step, select this scene 1 and scene 2. Let's move to inside main composition. Then select this solid and lock background layer. Let's select work area 6 seconds, press N and right mouse, let's select work area with trim comb to work area. Okay, and let's select this scene 2, move to up and move to right. Let's open scene 1 and let's make compositions. First step, select this layer and hold shift, select this and this layer and this layer t-shirt. Let's see. Okay, let's select this frame green. Nice. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, add name, object one. Click OK. Then back to scene one and let's select this yellow objects. Select this check green two and check green background, back and frame yellow. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, object two. Click OK, back to again scene 1 and let's select this phone, check yellow and check background yellow and frame red. Let's right mouse, again precoms, add name, objects 3. Click OK. So back to scene 1 again and let's select this line 1, line 11 and line 2, line 22, line 3 and line line 333. Let's right mouse, precoms, add name, lines. Okay, back to scene 1 again. Okay, nice. Let's select these object compositions. Let's press P and go to here. Make new position shape frame. Go to first second and let's select these object 3. Move to up and object 2. Move to right and object one, move to left. Let's see. Okay, select shape frames, make easy, go to graph editor, select this graph, let's make smooth graph. Let's see. Okay, that's good. So back to shape frames with this icon. And in this time, let's open object one and Select this check icon, let's go to paint tool, let's make one masking like this, click selection tool and go to effects presses, search effects stroke, select this stroke from generate folder, let's use for this check green one and change paint style, reveal original image, let's change brush size like this and brush hardness change 100 okay and let's change end 0 go to first second make end shape frame press u for c shape frames and go to here let's change end 100 let's see okay select shape frames make easy nice go to graph editor let's make smooth graph Okay, back to shape frames. Select last shape frame, move to right. Okay, that's good. So select this check background. Go to window, open animation composite 3. And let's open starter preset. And open here. Let's use overshot scale. Click in. Let's see. Okay, select this tier in. Let's move to right for slow animation. And select this check. Let's move to right. Let's move to left. Okay, that's good. Let's select it, check green one. Let's link to background and move to left. Okay, that's good. So, select this t-shirt and let's use again animation composite 3. Let's open effects to the layer. Open here. Let's select any effects. Okay, that's good. Let's select this t-shirt and click apply. Let's see. Nice, let's select this t-shirt, go to FX control and change intensity 25. Okay, nice. 
So, let's back to scene 1, let's see. Okay, nice. Okay, so, let's back to again object 1 and select this check layers, control C, and go to object 2. Let's move to this window down. Let's control V. Okay, and select this check background. Go to stroke. Go to effects preset. Short effect change color. And select this change color. Let's use for this background. And click this icon. I dropper. And select this yellow. And let's change who I transform. Like this. And change lightness. Okay, not bad. So select this checkbox and this let's select these layers move to here and select this background green press air chain rotation like this okay nice and let's select this animation composer select this back and let's use this effect click apply okay and change in test 25 okay nice let's select this anchor point move to here click session tool okay nice so select this check layers control c go to object 3 and go to first second control v let's see okay let's select this check green move to up here and select this background go to here and let's change to yellow let's select this change color let's control d and click reset let's select eye drop select this color inside color and change to search yellow okay that's good so let's select this checkbox and delay it select these layers move to here okay nice select this phone let's use again this effect click apply and change intensity 25 let's see okay nice so back to scene one and close animation comes there Let's go to center and select this object 3. Let's move to right and make like this graph. Okay, and select this object 2. Let's move to down, make graph like this. And select this object 1. Move to down, make graph like this. Let's see. Okay, select three frames. Hold Alt, move to left for fast animation. Nice. And let's select this mouse. Move to here. And after moving these compositions, let's press P, make new passing three frame. Let's press S, change scale. Let's see. Okay and press p go to here let's move to here okay and select three frames make easies and let's move to right to last three frame let's see okay and in this time hold shift press air go to here make rotation three frame and go to here chain rotation like this Select keyframes, make easies, and select these two passing keyframes. Go to graph editor, select this graph. Let's make graph like this. Okay, let's select last keyframes. Move to right. Okay, and in this time, select this mouse and let's move to like this. Change graph for smooth. Let's see. Okay. And in this time, let's hold Shift press S, make sketch shape frame, and go to six shape frame. Let's click here, right plus six, click OK, and change scale like this. Go to again six shape frame, click here, plus six, click OK. And select this scale shape frame, control C, control V. Select shape frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, let's select this shape frame. 
let's change like this okay and in this time select this object too and hold shift press s make scale shape frame go to here change scale 9 to 5 and go to here select first shape frame control c control v select shape frames make easy let's see okay let's select shape frames move right okay let's go to here select this shape frame let's change 97 okay and in this time select this mouse let's make new passing shape frame and go to here let's move to left select shape frames let's see select last shape frame move to right select two shape frames go to graph editor and let's select shape frame make smooth graph like this okay and go to center let's move to down okay let's select shape frames go to pen tool let's hold this icon select this convert to vertex let's make smooth like this and this let's see okay that's good click section tool and go to here make rotation shape frame and go to center let's chain rotation like this and go to last shape frame chain rotation like this let's see okay that's good let's select scale shape frames ctrl c and in this time make new scale and ctrl v let's see okay nice and select this scale shape frames ctrl c select this object one go to here press s make scale shape frame and ctrl v let's see let's move to right okay that's good let's do full animation nice okay so friends so friends let's select all these three frames for mouse and let's move to left let's see okay let's move to right move to left a little bit nice and select the scale three frame let's move to here select this scale move to here for fast animation let's see okay nice and finally let's make new passing shape frame for mouse and go to here move to up here and let's move to right this shape frame select shape frames go to graph editor let's make smooth graph let's see okay back to shape frames and let's in this time move to here and go to again select this tool let's let's hold this point make smooth and this let's see okay click station tool and go to here make rotation shape frame go to this shape frame change rotation like this and go to here change like this let's select shape frame let's move to here okay and select this scale shape frames ctrl c go to here and make new scale shape frame ctrl v then select this scale shape frames for object one select this object three go to here and press s make scale shape frame ctrl v let's see okay nice and in this time let's make new passing shape frame and go to here and move right let's see press b okay save shape frames make go to graph editor make graph smooth like this okay back to shape frames and go to here let's move to down 
select this icon make smooth graph click session tool and go to here make again rotation keyframe go to here chain rotation like this let's see let's move to right okay that's good so let's press n and select full work area let's see full animation okay we have problem with shape frames with this mouse let's select this all position shape frames and right mouse shape frame interpolation change current settings to linear click ok let's see again okay problem is solved nice 